Hello guys, uh, this is Adrian Walt speaking. Uh, today I will be talking a little bit about uh, the differences between shooters and guardians and also um, about the melee um, shooter ants, especially like uh, Predator. Okay, um, so first things first about Predator. I think it's a trash ant. Why is it a trash ant? Um, because it's uh, the skills 2, 4, uh, 2, 5 and 8. Uh, usually the skills, uh, active skills or passive things. And uh, here it's like uh, reduces the normal attack and skill damage taken by 20.5% uh, from the front line. Um, and only when it's in the front line, but this end uh, only makes sense there anyway. So, And uh, normal attack is what uh, the soldiers usually kill. And uh, the second attack you get is always the skills if uh, the ends proc on skills. Um, and it also increases the attack of our backline. The fifth skill here is after a normal attack, there is a chance to deal damage and reduces the next skill damage with a range of two, so it can uh, not even reach the backline, even if it's on front. And eighth skill is um, it reduces the skill damage taken by two random shooter and squads uh, by 21%. So, uh, and a healing ratio. The two random shooter squads um, this means, of course, that you have to play uh, all three roles with shooters, which is uh, most common anyway, um, to play second and uh, third line as shooters. But this also means it, it can um, choose itself to take less damage. But why is it so worthless to take less damage um, for shooters? Uh, for this and to answer, we have to take a look at uh, the troop types. Okay, here we are with Guardians, 9, tier 9 and uh, improved, so tier 9 plus. They have an attack of 77, defense 77 and health 20. And um, we will, uh, I will show you later also. The shooters have an attack of uh, 115, so way higher. And they also have the ability to be able to take uh, deal critical strikes. A critical strike means uh, one hundred fifty percent. And uh, in this game, and defense, they have uh, fifty one, and health they have thirteen. So you will see shooter are the glass cannons, who are able to deal deal a lot of damage, but uh, they cannot take a lot before dying. And uh, guardians are the opposite. They are very tanky, much more health, much more defense, and uh, much less attack. So, in the first row, you want something that uh, provides as a shield. Why is this also very important? Because uh, the special ants, they have uh, skills, and these skills are, uh, the, besides the number that you can see, like here it's um, 300% damage, plus a special end um, level and with golden crystal it's 280 percent but the special ends themselves do not deal this damage they actually they are like generals telling the soldiers that uh, are within their row to um, do this to deal the damage so if you have Already a lot of your ants and soldiers died, you will deal less damage even if the skill procs. So this is also why you want, want to have something in the front row that has maybe crowd control. Like uh, crowd control can be silence or um, suppression. Like things that block the enemy's uh, special ants to um, use their abilities, their skills. And this is also why it's fine to use Guardians in the first row because they are big fat meat shield and you will just utilize the things like the crowd control. It's enough to deal the silence that do not need to deal the damage. The second and most importantly the back row is actually the one you want to deal the damage because usually their soldiers get targeted the least because they are so far in the back. And this means the most of their ants can uh, still survive, so they can deal the damage. Okay, um, but why are some people still playing SSS? 
um, this is because of this end. This end is uh, only achievable to buy uh, through money, not in any other way, so far at least, and I don't think they will change this. And you will see, okay, the, the first, uh, the second skill is like um, increased defense. Yeah, we don't really care that much, but 71% chance to be immune to the first damage taken in each round is already nice to have. And here we have uh, one very important thing. Meanwhile, our backline will gain a wake effect to be immune to control effects, effects like exactly the things we talked about before. So if you combine this with like a Leffy Sniffer, another pay to win backline end, um, it works great because uh, it's the one that deals the damage. So this is the reason why this end is possible to play in in the front row and uh, also as it says but i think for it to really shine you still need more combat speed because if you have more combat speed even if it's one or 500 more combat speed you will always get in every round uh, the first attack like let's say to to give this a more um to, to describe this even more we have uh, simplified every row can only take 10 soldiers um, per row. So we have uh, 10, 10, 10, and the opponent also 10, 10, 10. If you have first strike and you proc some skills, let's say you kill uh, three um, soldiers in the front row, um, one in the middle row and one in the back row. So as we already know, the soldiers are a very important factor for the damage dealt. So even we are still in the first round and now it's the opponent's turn. The opponent now will have the problem uh, that he has only seven soldiers in the first row anymore. So he will be not be able to deal as much damage even if the same skills proc as yours. Like you're playing exactly the same lineups. And this is the same for the middle row and the back line also. And a fight is m maximum eight rows, uh, rounds, and in if you have more combat speed in every single round of these eight, you will get the first strike. So the this is also very important in my opinion, um, if you want to play SSS. So purely a shooter squad, and no guardians. For uh, non payers, it's in in my book essential to play guardians first row. You can even experiment with uh, guardian, guardian shooter, but uh, this is you need some ends that deal some damage, even if they are, uh, if even if the lead uh, guardians like leaf devourer, is insane for this thing. For example, is uh, a wall, a wall that still deals damage. So this is why I like to use it in the first row. Okay, that's about it. Um, I hope you understood what I mean meant. It's. It's probably a lot and I did not visualize a lot of it. Uh, just feel free to ask me any question on Discord. Have a great day. Bye.